folks, Shane Jacobson here, Bridgestone Ambassador for the 2015 World Solar Challenge. Here in Australia, we are still in Darwin, but right now we're at the Hidden Valley Race Circuit. So tomorrow's a big day. Tomorrow is the day they've got to go out and set their lap times to try and get that ever so wanted pole position. But today is their final day of testing, getting the setup of the cars right, which is so important. As you can imagine, with 3,000 kilometres still to travel down that road to get to Adelaide, there's a lot to get right and a lot of stuff. So let's go and meet some of our teams that will be competing and see some of the cars they'll be in. Okay, we're here with the Swedish team and guys, as in any motorsport, things only go right for a very short amount of time sometimes. You've got problems already, can you explain what's going on? Yeah, it's more of a... Uh, it's a brakes actually that uh, won't re uh, repel as quickly as we, we would have hoped, so so uh, we have to clean them and uh, everything with that. Uh, grease them up a bit. Grease them up, yeah, and the process with bleeding and so on before we have to go back to the track at 11. I need to hit the track. I've got to ask the obvious question, being from Sweden, it's a lot colder there, you're in Australia, it's a lot hotter here. Is heat playing a part of the trouble in this, do you think? No, I think actually not, but uh, will affect the team members so they do not work as fast I think yeah so the team members aren't working as well because it's too hot but the car's fine yeah definitely yes as I said before you know we should have uh, we should have help taking the AC down to about minus 10 then we would, would be just unstoppable oh, yeah, you want air conditioning in the car Joined here by two engineers, uh, this gentleman here, Takahiko Yamamoto, uh, is from Bridgestone, the Bridgestone Global Motorsport Department, one of the engineers, welcome, uh, and also Derek Sabi here, who's uh, one of our engineers from Bridgestone Australia. Um, we'll start with you if that's all right. Can you tell us a little bit about the tyre technology um, that the Bridgestone sponsored teams will be running this year? Okay. 18 teams will be running of tyres, uh, specially developed for their solar vehicles. So we've got to ask, mate, how do you think these tyres will perform in the challenge this year? Well, the, feed the feedback I've been getting from the teams with the Bridgestone tyres fitted this week has been extremely positive. They're all very, 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 very happy with the performance of the tyres. The tyres are going faster, uh, the cars are going faster, the tyres are, uh, tyres are behaving, behaving very well, uh, allowing um, the cars to go further with less energy because the race is all about energy conservation and energy, energy use. So um, a very positive uh, uh, point is the number of other teams who have been inquiring about tyres and they've been seeing how the Bridgestone tyres have been running and so uh, not say suddenly but they are becoming very a very popular item in the pits. <laughs> I'm sure they are. 